The Great Wall of China is one of the greatest sites in the world, the longest wall in the world, an awe-inspiring feat of ancient defensive architecture. Its winding path over rugged country and steep mountains takes in some great scenery. The 10 facts that you may want to know about the Great Wall of China. 1. How long is the Great Wall of China? 2. The history of the Great Wall of China. 3. The Great Wall of China map. 4. Who built the Great Wall and when? 5. Why the Great Wall was built? 6. How the Great Wall was built? 7. How tall is the Great Wall? 8. The Great Wall structure. 9. The Great Wall protection. 10. Great Wall travel. Fact number 1. How long is the Great Wall of China? The length of the Great Wall of China is 21,196.18 kilometers. The data came from the State Administration of Cultural Heritage. In 2009, the State Administration of Cultural Heritage first published data on the Ming Dynasty Great Wall, which measured 8,851 kilometers. Fact number 2. The History of the Great Wall of China. The Great Wall of China has a history of more than 2,000 years. The Great Wall of China's history began in the spring and autumn period 770 to 476 BC and was last rebuilt as a defense in the Ming Dynasty 1368-1644. During the spring and autumn period 770 to 476 BC and the Warring States period 475 to 221 BC, when the eastern and central region of what is now China consisted of many small states or princedoms, the princes ordered independent walls be built along state borders to protect their states. The earliest was probably built between the states of Lu and Qi around 650 BC, which later became part of the Chu State Wall. Qin Shivang, king of the state of Qin from 247 to 221 BC, conquered and unified the other states. Emperor Qin Shivang ordered that the northern sections of wall on state borders, especially the walls in the northern part of China built by the states of Qin, Zhao and Yan, be joined together to form a unified line of defense against Mongol harassment from the north, the first true Great Wall. Other state border walls became obsolete in a unified China and were subsequently eroded or dismantled. China flourished during the Ming Dynasty and its military might swell. The Great Wall was systematically rebuilt in a 100-year project to prevent further northern invasion. Most of the remaining Great Wall was built in the Ming Dynasty, and is known as the Ming Great Wall. The Great Wall sections close to Beijing like the Badaling section and Mushinyu section were built during the Ming Dynasty. Fact number 3. The Great Wall of China Map. The Great Wall mainly covers 15 provincial level areas, Beijing, Tianjin, Liaoning, Jilin, Heilongjiang, Hebei, Henan, Shandong, Shanxi, Shaanxi, Hubei, Inner Mongolia, Nengxia, Gansu, and Kanghi. Fact number 4. Who built the Great Wall and when? It's often said that the first emperor of Qin built the Great Wall. Actually he was not the first to build it. Zhou Dynasty, the pre-Warring States period 770-221 BC, state overlords built state border walls, the Qin Dynasty 221-207 BC, the first emperor of Qin linked the Great Wall sections on China's northern border, the Ha Dynasty 206 BC-220 AD, Ha Wudi extended the Great Wall west to Yuman Pass and beyond, the Ming Dynasty 1368-1640. 44. Hero General Qi Jigwang rebuilt the Great Wall around Beijing. Fact number 5. Why the Great Wall was built. In the Qin Dynasty, the first emperor of Qin inked the northern walls to prevent invasion from northern nations. In the Ha Dynasty, the emperors extended the Great Wall far into today's western China to protect Silk Road trade. Fact number 6. How the Great Wall was built. The majestic Great Wall was built with wisdom, dedication, blood, sweat, and tears. Families were separated, and many workers died and were interred as part of the Great Wall itself. Workers were soldiers, peasants, and rebels. Used materials are stone, soil, sand, brick, and material delivery by hand, rope, cart, and goat. 
Fact number 7. How tall is the Great Wall of China? The height of the Great Wall is 5 to 8 meters, 16 to 26 feet, where intact restored. It was designed to be at least three times the height of a man. Some of the wall was built along ridges, which make it look taller. Fact number 8. The Great Wall Structure. The Great Wall of China was not just a wall. It was an integrated military defensive system with watchtowers for surveillance, fortresses for command posts and logistics, beacon towers for communications. In the Ming Dynasty 1368-1644, the Great Wall was reconstructed to be stronger and more sophisticated, due to better construction techniques being developed. The wall body, the Ming Great Wall usually had battlements 1.8 meters 6 feet high with loopholes and crenels, and parapet walls 1.2 meters 4 feet high. Flanking towers, every 500 meters or less 1,640 feet on the Great Wall there was a flanking tower allowing defenders to shoot arrows at attackers at the face of the wall. Fortresses were built at important, vulnerable access points passes, such as Shanghai Pass Fortress, Zhuyong Pass Fortress, and Jiu Pass Fortress. There were many archery windows and gates on the forts. The fortress gatehouses were the strongest and most impregnable structures on the Great Wall. Fact number 9. Restoration and protection to the Great Wall. To prevent further loss of the Great Wall, the Chinese government has taken measures to protect it. Impose laws to protect the Great Wall and manage funds for protection, restoration, and maintenance. As individuals, we can do the follows to protect the Great Wall. Plant trees to keep the Great Wall slopes protected from erosion. Don't litter and graffiti, remove trash and graffiti. Don't damage the Great Wall, take bricks home, it's illegal. And the last fact number 10. Great Wall Travel. The Great Wall of China is the must-visit China attraction. Perhaps the most powerful advertising words in history come from the poetic pen of Chairman Mao, until you reach the Great Wall, you're no hero. Figuratively this has come to mean, to get over difficulties before reaching a goal. It is the greatest human feat in history. The Great Wall is the building project with the longest duration and greatest cost in human lives, blood, sweat and tears. It deserves its place among, the new seven wonders of the world, and the UNESCO World Heritage Sites. That's all for today and thanks for watching.